Welcome back, everybody, to Grim Tales Grey Witch. We are the world's greatest hidden object players, Aquatic Edition. My name's Michael. I'm Amanda. And uh, we're back into it, baby. We're here out among the trees under the moon to do a thing. What the <laughs> hell were we doing? <laughs> Uh, Apparently that wasn't it. That's not <laughs> what we need right now. It's not letting me look at the recipe to remind myself what we need to do the recipe. We're recipeing something. Yeah. I guess we just got access to here. So we've got some stuff to pick up here. Oh, what's this? Just gonna look around, grab some things. Whoa, <laughs> we did not have to throw it that hard. We were feeling a little spicy, I guess. Could have just set it down. <laughs> That's a great lantern to mount our uncle skull in oh yes come on he's not our uncle he's our dad oh that's right dad skull we found out last time that he was our actual father which bum, weirded bum, me bum. out because like i thought he was a distant ancestor not our dad that makes it actually weirder that our cousin was complaining to us about how obnoxious he was it's like that's my dad you were talking about i want to hear you talk shit about my dad her pendant is missing. Do we have a pendant for this lady? Yeah, I don't know. We got so much stuff in our pockets. It's a little much. Don't have a pendant. What's this? Another... Screensaver, baby. <laughs> no, I don't. Want Number you. two zero. Oh, she's missing rings too. This lady got jacked for all of her jewels. We don't have any of them. Sorry, lady. Good luck. Talk to your insurance company. What? Oh, we looked at this. Yeah. We're doing some sort of object seance thing. Yeah, we need two more uh, possessions of hers. Yeah. So d is anything in our pocket hers? I don't think so. I mean, unless she was a big planet collector, <laughs> planet amulet collector. We found so many amulets in this game. Is this her lantern? <laughs> we got to fix it anyway, regardless. Before we can do anything with it. Oh, oh. thanks, Dad. That's not Dad. That ghost wasn't him? No. He shows up, like, right in front of us with his little, you know, symbol on his forehead and stuff. He doesn't race around like a specter. He's a classier kind of ghost. Okay, I need to follow the recipe precisely. So is this where I need to put the recipe? Yes. Boom. All right. Green stuff goes in there, <laughs> gets hot. And then you add some hot water. And then you got super green stuff. Super wet green stuff. Then you turn the turn the dial one way to <laughs> do a thing, and then the red thing goes, <laughs> fakes know. left, goes right. We'll figure it out when the time comes. This is more broken sure. glass, just like the lantern. Yeah? Oh, yeah. <laughs> threw that out, too, but less violently. All right, over here, still can't do anything with this because we need the other piece. We only yeah. got one of them. We need the horseshoe. Mm -hmm. well, that's the only thing over there. There's something over here. What is this? We can do a thing if we uh, electro-zappy some metal. It'll melt. Right. But we don't have the stuff for that. No. What about over here? We do not have this. We need something to put that in. How about a net? <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Yeah, by definition, a net is not going to hold it. <laughs> I tried to use our dad's skull, which I thought was a good idea, but it won't let me. Right, and then we read that book last time. Mm -hmm. And we can't pick up any of this other stuff. Can we pick up that book off the steps? Um, oh, it's just a transforming thing. Yeah. Never mind. Should have ignored it. <laughs> Oh, the gas looks poisonous. We can go into it with our gas mask on. Oh. Do we do we want to do that? Okay. Cool. Now we can breathe anything. <laughs> oh, and this is a, a kind of hidden object scene. So we're, what, looking for horns? This is like a fragmented object scene, the ones that you hate. Yeah, don't like them. So we're looking for metal-looking things that seem out of place. Yeah. And they're easy because the light hits them weird. Yeah, they've actually been a little tricky and put some things in here that look like the weirdness. Like, this is not actually a part, even though it looks like one. Mm. 
So this is less bad than these typically are. And you see the last one? Yeah, straight up from the... There you go. <clears throat> hey, that's a replacement for the broken thingy. Hooray! I guess that's all we needed from there. Yep, not gonna do anything about the poison gas. Just dipped in and out. Alright. All right. So the green powder is the thing we can't bring from the other table yet. Yeah. We don't have any water. I mean, we have, we have a book right here, and we could just scrape the powder onto the paper. And Unpossible! Then, and then bring it over on that. It's not really... Anti-science. You could improvise other solutions nope. here. Okay. You'd stick it in your mouth and then spit <laughs> it out when you go over to the other table. <laughs> just don't swallow it and you're fine. <laughs> I took a chemistry class in high school. <laughs> Let's look at the map. Alright, it looks like there's something to do here. And still more to do in the room we just left. But we know that we've got stuff to do in there. We just don't have everything we need to do it. Alright, so what are we doing? We have to cut this. And we don't have anything for that. Too bad you threw away that glass instead of keeping a piece. Uh, I think we already pulled stuff out of this bag. Yeah, I agreed. We, all we need to do is cut this and I don't... We don't have anything for that. I think we already visited the well. We, we do need that water, though, for the recipe. Yeah, we do. I don't know what we transferred into, though. Maybe we'll find something eventually? I don't know. I guess we can't just take the bucket. And then, wasn't there something up in the tree? Right, there's the distant pin. Okay, things are glowing. Right, we saw a spirit come up here, so now we're capturing that spirit in our time device thing. He was supposed to marry me. Abigail, please. Surely there are other... Don't you give me your pity, Harpy. You stole him from me. I don't know what you're talking. Silence! <laughs> I guess it's pretty funny. <laughs> Think about it. She got thrown off a cliff by Pee, -Pee Longstocking. That's probably who that was. I saw red braids. That's clear iconography. It's a trademark. There's a ring missing. Do we have the missing ring? We have a planet. You want a planet? We don't have the missing ring. No ring. ring. And that's keeping us from getting the Phoenix pendant. Well, there we go. Follow that ghost. Uh huh. Back to here. Another flashback. can't hear me but i swear on my immortal soul that i will bring you back whatever aren't you supposed to have an immortal soul there buddy a well, soul if, that lives on past your life if he believed in an immortal soul he would just kill himself to be with her no nope, that's a sin he would just wait until he died to be with her yeah big crybaby why don't you just wait till you die but since he doesn't believe in an immortal soul he only believes in his mortal soul the only way to be with her is to bring her back from He's the dead. He's a materialist. He's a materialist. I could use this soft sand to create a casting mold. I guess we're going to do that with this uh, key, key that we're trying to put together, maybe? Maybe. There's nothing else there. I thought maybe there was a different thing at the base of the statue, but it doesn't seem like it. Alright, map. What's still open? This is the shore. Right here. And when there's something to do here? Do we have pliers to pull that out now? We don't. Hmm. I don't really know. Oh, wait, do we have something else of hers? Did we, we didn't pick up anything else of hers. Since know, we should we try here. the planet amulet? I mean, I guess we can. Nope. What about the net? Is she big into <laughs> collecting bugs? I don't think she was a butterfly collector. No. Dang. I guess I didn't know her at all. <laughs> Alright. 
part of the key broke off from the lock, but it's too small to pull out. And we don't have any, we still don't have anything for that. We've got so much stuff to do that we don't have any. So much stuff to pull out. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna go for a hint. Cause we've clicked everywhere that's live pretty much and done everything that we've been able to do. Oh wait. Nope, we only have half of this. Yeah, we've only got half of everything that we need. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the hint. There's tweezers right there. I did not see them. I thought they were part of this assemblage. Now huh? we can go pry a whole bunch of things out. <laughs> Key that we can recast in the sand. Uh, hey, where are those tweezers? What the? Lady, you knew there was another thing to pull out right here. Lady, we looked right at it. <laughs> Please keep a thing in your hands for just two minutes. We were going straight there. Oh my god. Throw no. it in the river. This is not the thing we're going to recast, apparently. Why would we not cast a new key? Uh, maybe we're going to repair the existing key over here. Doesn't it kind of look like that's what this is for? The melted metal? Maybe. See? Yeah. We're going to solder these two together, basically. So. Alright. Um, that does not... Pull the lever. No, not the clamp. The one sticking out of the frame on the right. Oh. Ah. Bzz, bzz. Okay. Whole key. Whole ass key. Thank you. This is where the key goes. What else needs a key? I know. Let's just huff some poison gas. <laughs> think they'll let us and we already opened this so there's nothing that we, we need, need something key. sharp here yeah we don't need a key for here did <laughs> the, the key belong to her is it a precious key no well, it's got to be for opening something is there a keyhole over here in a tree I'm I'm just trying things okay mm -hmm. I'm just looking around <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. Where does this key go if it doesn't go in that very obvious keyhole? Oh, do we have There's this? There's a little bird pendant. Do we have this bird? We do not have this bird. What the heck do we have? We do. We have stuff, but we don't have anything we need for anything. Like, what's this? That's the shore. That's here. That's, yeah, okay. It says there's something else we can do here, but I don't know what. Okay, let's let's pick something. Like, what else? What else needs a key? This does not need a key. Nothing over here needs a key. Nothing here needs a key. There what, needs a, what do they need? This needs the other half of this. Or. Or some green powder. Uh huh. We don't have. Or any. some water. We got no way to get water here. Anything else? Uh, it looks like all it wants is green powder and water, and then the rest is just moving some dials. Hmm. Did, this is the unpickupable powder. Are you just picky about where I put it? I don't think that's what I need right now. It's not picky about where I put it. I'm putting it right on there. I'm gonna go for a hint again. I don't really know what the deal is here. Well, we almost had the last one. What? The tweezers. We don't have the other half of this. What are you trying to tell us? This. What do we need this for? A crucible. Oh, that goes over by the key making thing. Okay. 
So at some point we'll get some metal, something. I guess. Which we don't that have. Doesn't help us very much. What's in the? Uh, go back to the crucible area. What's in the box there? The red box. We've already gotten the thing out of here, and this oh. is just the padding that was sitting on. Yeah, we know that we can electrify some cube of metal if we had a cube of metal. Yeah, I am... This makes me think maybe one of these tableaus has something else to pick up like that. Like the tweezers? Crucible and the tweezers, yeah. Alright, like, I've clicked on everything here. There's the book that you can flip through. There's the... Like, there's nothing else I see here I can click on. Yep. We cannot... There can't be anything there because it's not live anymore. Mm-hmm. Here, the, the reason that you can still click on it is because there's an emblem to stick there, but there's nothing we can Because we can't pick steal up. the handle or the bucket. For some reason, we can't take that bucket for the water. We need to cut this. We still don't have anything to cut it with. We've gotten everything out of it that we can. Mm -hmm. And then the tree is waiting for us to do what again? It's waiting for the last ring the last of this ring puzzle. to show up. And then Which we, we might be forging reach this from here can we oh we can use the net to get that all right now we're moving there we go so is that a yeah last half of that cool something to pry the thing out of the tree and maybe something to put water in or powder powder there we go powder acquired so i visit the tree mm-hmm Here we go. Give me this. Don't know why you couldn't just use the tweezers for that, lady. Needed something heavier. And then we throw that heavier thing out into the ocean. <laughs> right. All right, well, now we've got this. So this is one of the rings that we need back there. Uh, yep. But this is just one, of, one two, of two, so we've got to get the other one first. Pendant as well. Yeah. All right, uh, so we can start this, I guess. Drop the powder off. Why couldn't we just pick up that fucking bowl and use it? I don't know. I guess we already had water. All right, that's in the right spot. Uh huh. And then you got to put it in the other direction to move the other thing. Oh. This is one of those things where they affect each other? Yep, but I think you got it. Because now we got super goop. Wow, I'm so glad we have this a acid. What do we need acid for? <laughs> uh, are we going to acid this open? That'd be funny. That's what yep. we're doing! <laughs> Can't find uh, the key, so fuck it. Alright. Oh shit! This case keeps getting more intriguing. Agree to disagree. The scientist was a true genius. Combining magic and technology, I'm jealous. I sense a magic anomaly on the shore, along with Victor's incomplete ritual. Perhaps you should return to the past, to the day before the tragedy. Okay, Dad. This prism allows you to see things hidden by magic. I suppose you'll just have to see for yourself. <laughs> no. I guess that's pretty funny. More time travel? Well, I'm practically an expert at it by now. Uncover Victor's fate. We figured it out. I, what was his fate? It was in that letter that I clicked on briefly. And now we and can't go now back we and can't read it? go back and read it. Did it end up in our book? No, our book is just a map. Is yeah, there a pencil don't... on the left that lets us revisit stuff? Uh, no, this is a walkthrough menu. <laughs> Holy crap, they give you a cheat sheet right here. <laughs> okay, good to know. <laughs> well, so something happened to Victor. Uh, those with uh, really quick reflexes can hit pause for the split second we glanced at it. <laughs> but we are never going to know. Yep. All right, we need to put the rings on the statue. Let's see if this does a thing. 
No, nope, we need the pendant before anything will happen. Lane. What was there here? Someone stashed That's going to open here. up. All right, okay. Um. Prism. I bet the prism goes on the spell display. Don't you think? Probably. Um, but I just... There was another place for a key, but it's not... Wait, it is the key. It's we the still key. have a key. It's this key. Of course, this is by where we got it. I don't know why I missed that. So, three more of those. Wait, what? Are we undoing it? This is a oh, broken, broken amulet, so we're going to go fix this over here. Jam crackers, but we pick up a lot of jobs for ourselves. <laughs> and now we got to... What? Um, pour liquid metal into it? I guess. <laughs> I feel like it's going to cool by the time we get down all those stairs. Not if we hustle. Yeah, it's always a good idea to hustle when Just you've got molten you got... metal in your hand. Wait, four daggers? <clears throat> the only four things in there? Hell yeah, let's knife somebody. <laughs> and don't lose this lady. She's going to lose it. She's going to throw it away as soon as we cut this leather thing open. Oh. What? I'm trying to click here. What are you doing? Well, they're chucking stuff at us right and left now. Where's the ring? Yep. Planetary ring. Alright. Well, it kind of puzzles this. Rotate the ring so all the matching symbols line up. On each concentric ring, the outer ring cannot move. That's not really a puzzle. It's just matching. Like... It's just matching. Okay. Great. Star and sun amulets. So many amulets. Which one of these is yours, lady? She's got a teardrop shape on hers. She's looking for a pendant. Those go in with the other astrological one we dropped off in that floor area. Oh, you're right. Alright, there's the star. There's the sun. We need to cast this one, and then we need the and moon. And then we'll find a moon somewhere. We don't have the moon. All right. Um, we need we need to repair that lantern too. Oh, how about repaired. that? Repaired. All right. Uh, because I think what we needed that for was this to go into the dark door. Yeah, which I keep clicking on by accident, and then I can't find it when I try to do it on purpose. Okay. That's probably where we leave when we've solved this whole area. These stones seem a little loose as something behind them. Unless a pickaxe shows up. Like, what do we need this for if not for this? Is it part of this? This looks like it's got everything it needs, except for the two things that go in these cups. And something else that belongs there is probably going to pop out of the statue once we open the yeah the, the hidden area. Right. Hmm. So we got to melt some metal. Yeah, which we don't have. What are we supposed to use the... Oh, here, we can look at this again. Finally! Having combined magic and technology, I can bring someone back to life. However, I'm concerned about the risk of failure. Who knows what kind of creature can come back to life? I have to risk it. <laughs> Emily, I will resurrect you. <laughs> that's pretty much what he sounded like. Yeah, that's, that's about accurate, I think. It keeps gleaming over here. Like, okay, I get it. You, there's something else to do here, but you haven't given us the metal. And just keep throwing electrical shocks at everything until it sorts itself out. <laughs> That's probably how he resurrected her. Just kept on electrical shocking her. All right. Oh, man, where does this go? Magic lantern. Like, there's a limited number of places we even have access to at this point. 
Can we... Oh, it does go here. Uh, okay, we oh. did a thing. I don't know how that worked. Don't know what we did or how we did it, but it's done. Thank you, hidden object game logic. <laughs> All right. Boom. A lock of her hair. Just got to fill one more cup uh, with another thing. Yep. From somewhere. From somewhere. We got to go back into the past. Uh, where do we go back into the past from? Or is this what we're trying to do go, to go back into the past? It's probably it. Time echo. Like. Oh no. Oh, we just drop it off. That's the last thing. We had it in our pocket the whole time. Huh. Well, it, we had to go capture all those spirits with it first anyway. That's true. Direct the flow of energy from the center to each gem and each of Emily's possessions by rotating the tiles so all lines connect. Uh, what now? Are the colors supposed to match? I don't see how they could. Oh, I mean, red. Wait. Oh, I mean, center has blue and that has blue, so that's got to go that way. Yeah. Hmm. So that next one up needs to be rotated so a blue touches it. There we go. So really, you just needed to make a hexagon. Yep. Hmm. Restore the scene by choosing glowing pink fragments and placing them in their matching reality tears. Well, that's a different kind of thing to All have right, to so do. Alright, so it's going to give us puzzle pieces and you just have to literally find the puzzle piece. It matches. We'll fix reality. Yeah, I mean, it's a so jigsaw puzzle. So it's reveal and then drag game. and drop. It's a almost finished jigsaw puzzle. Hmm. Irregular shapes. So what is this that we're looking at, do you think? I don't know, some dead girl. I mean, we did see her die. Yeah, so I get shoved off a cliff. Why not? Isn't that the same shape? It looks like it. It's not letting me put it there. Well, that'll do a different one. Yeah, he wants to do it in a different order. We're not picky. Who knew it'd be so much work fixing reality? <laughs> okay. All right, if it wasn't Pippi Longstocking who pushed her, who was it? It was our time traveling cousin. Whoa, that would be a twist. Why? Why? It won't take this one. Like, this doesn't fit anywhere else. And it won't spawn another one. That is literally that shape. That is, that goes there. Why are you not taking it? I so think this the game is bugged. Is bugged. Skip. All right. Where's the skip? Uh... Is there a skip? I don't see a skip. We may be stuck. Oh no, reality! <laughs> reality refuses to heal! What do we do? What does it say if we ask for a hint? Oh, really? <laughs> you think? Oh! Okay. That fixed it. Okay. We got past the bug by asking it what the hell it was talking about. All right. Whatever works, man. Yeah. 
Great work. This will come in handy. <laughs> Hi, Dad. This place is curious, isn't it, Anna? This place is bathed in magic energy. I guess. I haven't felt a place like this. As usual, it seems you need your father's help here. Just don't let me spoil the solution. No, we know where we know where that goes. Thanks, bud. Enter the tower. It said we time traveled to before the tragedy, but we clearly time traveled to just after. <laughs> Shortly after the tragedy. Alright. So all we're left with is the one we gotta reforge. And maybe we're gonna melt this thing. Yeah, cheap, cheap bracelet. bracelet. <laughs> we're gonna melt this thing and turn it into the pendant. We went back into the We past. went back in time to insult her taste in jewelry because we're just going to melt it down. To get a piece of metal when there's metal laying around everywhere here. Let's now we'll grab just... that with our bare hands. Yep. <laughs> right in the old hip pocket. Ski-daddle down the stairs. Hot, 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 hot. <laughs> into the sand. Right. Hot, 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 hot. Bare oh hands, goodness. bare hands. And we even took the time to carve some grooves into the top. Nice. We went, really went above and beyond there. Oh boy. Ro take the rings to place the celestial amulets, amulets as indicated by their colors. They will light up when correctly placed. Uh. Okay, so the green is on green and you can see the purple's on red, so. All right. Yep. Does that count as blue or silver, or what's the deal? They'll light up, so that's yellow on top. Oh, okay. Uh, blue might be behind the sun. Yeah. Alright, so we want to rotate this out so that... So that the purple replaces that. And then we want uh, green to replace that. All right, so we got that one done. <laughs> Unfortunately, yellow needs to move up one. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, skip. <laughs> Do we have? Oh yeah, we have a skip now. Yep. Anna, I'm so glad you're here. Stacy, behind you. Wait, Anna. I know what you're going to say. But it's not what you think. You've been tricked. You can't trust Abigail. This is no monster. I don't know. This is Emily. I can explain later, but we must go to the tower. Were we working with an Abigail? I, I don't remember. Was she Stacey the- Stacy told me all about who you are and where you come from. It's incredible. Thank you for your help. And thanks to Victor, I'm alive again. Though I'm a little different. When I recovered, he was already dead. But we can bring him back to life, too. Sh should, should we, though? <laughs> Unfortunately, Abigail stole Victor's papers that describe his experiments. I can't help him without them. Also, his body <gasps> is in the morgue. Are we going to steal a body? Hell yeah. We should split up. I'll wait here. You head back to town through the tunnel and find everything you need. You'll need a torch because that tunnel is pitch dark. We had a lantern. We only had a prism in it, though. Oh. Prepare a torch. Yep. Yep. And take a brat doll off the steps. <laughs> to break it open with something. Like a hammer? No, these are metalworking amulets. Oh. <laughs> Obviously. Oh, my goodness. Nobody needs 21 screensavers. I think maybe a single screen. <laughs> I think maybe you have to collect them all to get a screen saver. No, thank you. Uh, I'll need some ignition to get a fire going here again. All right, all right. Ignition. There's a lab behind this door. There's where the metalworking stuff's gonna go. Was there a paper here? What's this paper? It's a code. Mm-hmm. Great. Handle broke off. There's a hammer there on the left, though. That's another amulet. 
crowbar. Where did we get this crowbar? <laughs> right? When did that end up in our inventory? <laughs> we had one earlier and we were mad at the protagonist for throwing it away. Is our inventory incomplete? Like we have stuff, but our protagonist won't tell us that we have stuff? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> all right, so now we got all the metal working jiggers. I think I could break this open. Yeah, use your iron fist. Uh, or the crowbar. crowbar. There we go. Got the caffeine molecule. <laughs> uh, some kind of cube fits here, sure. Uh, no, this wasn't where we needed to bust something up. That was here. Well, bam. What? It's literally what it's for. Hammer it. I have to break it open with something. Crowbar. Ballot. All right, crowbar. No. Neither of the two things that break things up. Gotcha. Is this another bug? <laughs> the uh. comedy bonk sound. <laughs> all right. They won't let us do that until we have them both. But we have all of these. So What's this, a sucker? Thor's ohm. Switch handle. Uh, Omega amulet. All right. Over here, switch handle. Uh-huh. That looks like a dumb, dumb sucker. More. This place is Looney Tunes. <laughs> is that a silhouette of someone flying? Yeah, you may Good. well ask, lady. Don't think about it too much. <sighs> Recreate the combination shown on the note by pressing the arrows to line up the symbols in the correct row and column. So, you know, pink sun on the left. Uh, I guess I can only go one way. All it's right. right and down. Okay. Mm. Blue uh, mound. Okay. All right. And then this thing? Yep. So move it right twice, down twice. And yay! All right, into the lab. You sure see what's on really the slab. Any? The Inquisitor told me to destroy the mage's things complete. Hey, be careful. We'll have fireworks next time. But this might help us find something useful here. Oh, snap. Smoke bomb. Uh, who was that? Were those guards? Yeah, I think so. I need some chemicals here. And don't we all. So this is a bomb that they were going to use to blow everything up. And we interrupted them just in time. Okay. Cool. And we got a screensaver as a reward. Oh, here's some pages. The, these are kind of small for something you're expected to read. The alch I'm sorry. The alchemist found a rare chemical essence, a substance like the Philosopher's Stone that can revive Emily's body. Uh, light reflected by crystals creates a healing effect. Blah, blah, blah. Moving on. Sketched out a device so it's going to look like this. It's all for Emily. It worked. Emily's back. Many crystals are cracking due to pressure, so I'm running out. One is missing, so you gotta look for that kind of crystal. Finally discovered the optimal crystal placement. I'm certain my next experiment will be successful. Great. Optimal crystal placement. They keep threatening me, but those fools just don't understand. I can defeat death if I can discover the right formula for reanimation. If they try to stop me, I'll use sleeping gas. It's easy to make. In the steam pressure vessel, mix some chemical substances with the gas from the container hidden in the wall on the first floor. You know, some chemical substances. Any will do. Look, if you got steam and some <laughs> chemicals, you're most the way there. From the container hidden in the wall on the first floor. Alright, we don't have the other part of this. So, many weird shaped keys. Yep. Uh... And over here. Oh, grab some stuff off the floor. No? No. 
Can't have any of it. What is with all these shapes? That's they've got a key maker in the village who just only does weird shapes. Only does oh, weird it's shapes. Oh, an acid. Can't stick our hands in there. Well, that's a better excuse than most of these things give you. Oh, I don't want to put my delicate hands in spider webs. Is there paper sticking out behind it? Yeah. Despite uh, that the acid in the bathtub is weakened, it removed most of the rust from the amulet. Reminder, add salt for a stronger effect. What do I add for a weaker effect? Like, no effect. <laughs> like, how do I, how do I neutralize the acid? It's not going to tell us. This is sparking. What's this? I need a tool to pull it out safely. Do you need a crowbar? No. <laughs> I know. I was just checking. Alright. Alpha and Omega. Alright. So now at least something to pull it out safely. Another page. But this one we can't read. You don't need to know. Don't need to know. We're set. So pull it out with the old pliers. Okay. Now it'll definitely work because we snipped it. It needs a fresh battery. Sure. It's a diagram of all the electrical devices in the tower. This should help me get them working again. Uh, okay. Well, I remember there was a cube over here that we needed throwing in, so use this. Enter the dimension cube. <laughs> the get Tesseract. A, get a uh, pile of stuff. Blowtorch is useless without fuel. That's uh -huh. a, such an elaborate blowtorch. Uh, magnet on a string is nothing new, but it sure is effective if only we had string, which we do not. Alright. Alright. There's something in the chandelier. How can I knock it down? With your crowbar. God damn it. With a hammer. With yeah. a screwdriver. Throw the hammer. Throw the torch. Nope. None of it. What is the thing to the right of the pliers? Uh, chisel. Mm. Not a long pole, sadly. <laughs> Dang. No, no, no. Okay. Malvina. What's the red stuff? Scoop Hot of poles. coals. Oh, well, that, we can start a fire anyway. Right. We can get the hot coals out of our pocket. <laughs> Yowza. Uh, now do we need, yeah, fan the flames a bit. So we need like a bellows or a fan. We need to, f we have to blow Finish it up to, <laughs> what? What? <laughs> blow it up? <laughs> I guess this is not a feather shaped amulet. I, I mean, that's really what it looks like, but. Nope. This, this, one this is the one we can sense there's no amulet <laughs> and explosives are called for. Oh man. All right. Here we go. Of the many things. Oh, nice. One of those. <laughs> oh, oh. You didn't get very far. We said we we're going to split up. How's your mission going? I just you can't even click and interact with wow, her. Wow, just, just staring us down. Stand there. Uh, All right, creepy. Okay, God, can we so... bash our way in there yet? Crowbar? Crowbar. No, the other half of the thing. Yeah, I don't remember where this one goes. Uh, I don't know. We've seen like a half dozen different places to put stuff. I know. Uh, probably in the lab, since that's where there's an open, open question. So, of the many places where amulets can go, this one goes here? Yep. There's the bellows. And, and a what? glass cutter. Okie doke. Have we seen glass anywhere? I'm sure it'll turn up. Now I can use this fire to light something. Torch? I wonder if we're going to leave this all behind because we got a torch that'll take us into the tunnel. Maybe. Alright, glass cutter. Where is their glass? Like, we need a sharp thing for this, but not 
glass. How about this? If it's cutting wires, why can't it cut these ropes? What if we or the set fuse. the ropes on fire? Hey, hey that's dynamite. <laughs> I know. Easy there. <laughs> she won't let us use anything anyway, so I might as well get crazy. <laughs> I'd be very amused if you could actually get a game over on a hidden object game. He's like, well, you lit some dynamite. You obviously wanted to die. <laughs> so many emblems all right was there anything over here that needed a glass cutter no there's just acid and a thing another emblem here so, so much stuff if we could scoop it out yeah. um can we look at our tools again oh you think that's what the magnet on the string is for to pull it out of the acid probably but we don't have the string like, where do we get string from Oh, another morphing object. Thank goodness for that. All right. Should we go? <laughs> Stacy, you're creeping me out so much. <laughs> like, should we go ahead and try to look in here for something? Yeah, I think so. All right. Anna, wait. Give me the torch. I know the way. I'll guide you there faster. Just trust me, okay? Abigail must have hidden Victor's papers inside her house. However, those guards are still looking for us, so I'll keep watch outside. Once you find the papers, bring them to me. Then we'll find a way to reach the morgue. Prepare a torch to walk with Stacy, who already has a torch. No, that's task completed. We just finished that by giving her the torch. Okay. Alright, find Victor's stolen papers and give them to Stacy. I guess this is stuck, but I think I can pry it open. Okay. Je jewelry box. She needs to be open with a key. Crowbar. <laughs> we... Crowbar opens many things. Uh -huh. Well, we threw away the crowbar, so. Son of a... What else was up there to steal? It's locked, of course. Flower amulet. So that might have opened one of the many, many shapes in the last place. Mm-hmm. Doesn't it look like there's two more above the fireplace? So those golden amulet things? Those were things that we used to open a thing earlier. No, oh, we already did that. Yeah, we already did completed that earlier. Um, we were here before, and this is... Okay, this is Abigail's hat. More crests, huh? Even the protagonist is getting kind of tired yeah, of this Yeah, more shit. crests, more amulets. Ooh, razor blade. That's handy. We can use that to cut the dynamite off. So much stuff over oh my here. God. All right. But not that. Not that. We, we don't... know we'll never find a shape like that to unlock something. Okay. We can so sense it. Jewelry box key. Uh, what is that? Code Check. note. Code note. Great. But she's following You were us. supposed to wait. Where's the torch? <laughs> you had one job. <laughs> All right. Let's, um, let's look at the map. Abigail's house. Still stuff to do there. No, nowhere else. Only Abigail's house. All right. Um, We're not done ransacking this place. I guess not. Though, are we supposed to go back and forth between here and the and the lab? Maybe not. Oh, we got the code thing that matches this. All right. So. Arrange the gems so that the number in each section matches the hint. Press the teardrop gems to swap the gems between each section. What? Oh, there's supposed to be eight yellow gems in the lower right and eight in the upper left. Huh. Is it... Okay. Uh, what? or is it eight on top, eight on bottom? How many move every time? Uh, I think it's a... It looks like... Uh, nine. Oh. But then there's not nine slots over here. Right. So this, so this is, is, is a variant of the uh, liquid flask puzzle. Yeah. 
cool. I hate that puzzle. <laughs> yeah, it's not great. Also, what? why is it skipping over here? Because it's top and bottom, I think. I don't... Mm, I don't like it. I don't like it, and I am going to skip it. All right. I don't like how those controls work. I don't mind doing the um, the liquid type puzzles and stuff, but I don't like how those controls work. Chloe, who are all these people? I guess they're from the other games. To be this... fair, they could have been in this game. Yeah, we wouldn't know. <laughs> right, we don't even remember who Abigail is. And apparently we've been in her house and she's important to the story. Something has been sewn into this. Okay. Now keep that razor blade. She didn't keep the razor blade. Lady. <sighs> All right, I'll need a good old fashioned can opener for this. What about a glass cutter? All right, all right. You're gonna be picky, I can tell. Oh! Uh, <laughs> gotta be a way I can get rid of this safely. Does there? I like how it squeaks. <laughs> Angry little scorpion squeak. <laughs> I don't think scorpions sound like that, but I appreciate the sound effect nonetheless. What if we have it fight a toy soldier? Yeah, throw that at it. Mm. No. <laughs> Are we gonna blowtorch this poor scorpion? That'd be pretty cool. How about if we just swipe it with a skull? No. We beat a guard to death with that skull. It should be able to take the scorpion. I think. Is that uh, oil there and a little lantern on the side table? See to the right of the... You would think, but it's not clickable. Because I feel like we have a blowtorch that could use something. Uh-huh. All right. What is this? This is not something it's, we can... You know, sandbag. One of those... Suspended sandbags for that everybody's got. We need sand by your ceiling. <laughs> All right. Um, is there something else down here? A uh, can opener. Was there anything else? Can't pick that up. All right. We can't pick up anything from over here. This is not. This is not clickable. Just this Scorpion thing. Scorpion and boat. That thing and this. Yeah. Like, uh, you would think, since there's a ladder here, that you could go up in here and look at these things, but no. Nope, you just accidentally click on a morphing thing. Like, this looks like mysterious, whatever's over here in the Is dark. Is that not the tunnel we came out? No, the tunnel was in a different room. Oh. The tunnel's here. You're right, we're one room away from there. We're in like a secret room behind the portrait. Full of things that we can't click on. <laughs> we so, don't want to snoop too much. Some free red wine in the lower right. <laughs> Can we take that? Sure not. Nope. Nope. Alright. Got all this stuff. Alright, we've got some shield emblems. There's got to be ways to... We can to... fill in a couple more emblems. Yeah, there's got to be emblems here that So that one looks that. like axes. These are not shield shaped. That one maybe? No, that's only one and we've got two. Two shields. Um maybe it was back here? Like here's where this There's guy goes. Soldier. Uh is this a bullet? That's a bullet. <laughs> one bullet. <laughs> okay. Good good to have, I guess. Something in the chandelier. Right, and we still don't have anything we can knock that down with. We still don't have a uh, blowtorch fuel to get this open. Where did these shields go, though? I guess I could check the map for what's open to do. And still just Abigail's house. Did, were the shields to open something here? Oh, they're yep. here! Sure enough. Ruby no insecticide. <laughs> oh. So we're gonna kill the scorpion with that. Aww. Sorry, buddy. Sorry. Well, maybe he ran away. I 
Okay. Griffin amulets, which go over here, I believe. Uh huh. Kaklak. Is that. What am I looking for? I think the little silver thing is kind of in the middle by the bag. Yep. And one more thing. Okay. Can opener. <laughs> All right. You know how you keep those in pieces? Sure. Under lock and key. There's the boat. This room is ridiculous. Yeah, this is very silly. All right. We're coming up on time. All right. Should we save this? puzzle for next time this exciting this is too exciting for us to go out on <laughs> everyone will be like what happened after the the shape puzzle where you had to pay attention to light and shadows <laughs> shapes cannot be rotated all right well this was one where we were stymied kind of a lot not not super obvious where you need to go and what you need to pick up in this one Maybe because they're all variations on you need to pick up a weird amulet and then you need to put it in a weird amulet slot to get more amulets. <laughs> amulets on amulets on amulets. It's true. Use a dang key, people. Like, there's these exciting parts where you're like, oh, go back in time, repair rips in reality, find more amulets. I can't believe that we went back in time to witness Emily's murder and all we took was a cheap bracelet to melt down into <laughs> to make into an amulet <laughs> sorry about your murder but you'll be happy to know all the amulets in the world are in place i am excited the next time we're going to be robbing a morgue from a body yes if we could just reanimate body one body a, a this body will all be worth morgue. it all right we'll see stick you with us folks we got some necromancy ahead <laughs> later bye